Good everybody. I'm Keith Coons. We begin with a developing story from the shoreline. Police in several communities are now trying to determine if several cases of vandalism are connected. So far, nobody's been hurt, but police arrested two men this morning after they say they went on a BB gun shooting spree. Cars and homes have been damaged by BB pellets in Clinton, Old Saybrook, Waterford, and other areas. News 8's Stephanie Simone found out the shooting spree is not the only thing they're in trouble for. A BB gun shooting spree spanning several towns ends up with two people behind bars and police conducting a search warrant at this old Saybrook home. Shattered car windows like this one littered the shoreline. Police say this pair of lifelong friends with a BB gun are to blame. If there's young kids, we have, you know, animals running around and, you know, BB guns. Yeah, guns kind of scare me. Yeah. Police say 20 year olds Garrett Bush and Maxwell Bravi are the shooters. Detectives spent the morning searching Bravi's home. Officers say their shooting spree started on Sunday, even going all the way to Mohegan Sun. Look at these surveillance photos in Waterford. Then police say they targeted East Lime, at least two cars in Westbrook, and six cars at shopping plazas in Clinton. We believe this was just a random act of stupidity. Stupidity that could land them in more trouble. The spree stopped last night after Old Saybrook police say they targeted Cornfield Point along Hartsland Drive. Police there recognized their faces in surveillance photos and knew them from previous run ins. You know, we're hoping to find out through questioning as to why they would do this. You know, it's it's dangerous. Police arrested them and say they confessed to the crime, and now they've got canines searching Bravi's home for drugs. The information they provided us will hopefully help the other jurisdictions resolve their cases. It probably was a prank. I mean, just kids fooling around. I would hope that would be it and not doing it just to ruin someone's property. Bravi and Bush have been charged with reckless endangerment and some weapons charges. Police say drug charges will also be on the way. In Old Saybrook, Stephanie Simone, News 8.